At age 10, I fell in love for the first time. Suggest you take him to a psychiatrist. This is Nitoslavsky at reception has a list of referrals. But my mother never did take me to see a psychiatrist. For me, the world was just too brash, too bright, too loud. And there's no foreseeable prospect of any of that changing. But what I do have, finally, thanks to a long wait and a back issue of Psychology Monthly, are some answers. I am a sensor, which doesn't explain why I choose to live in this sensory overload, otherwise known as a city of millions. It must be the sacrifice I'm making for the collective betterment of the species. The evolution of culture, progress, democracy, where everyone lives together but in self-imposed exile. The sad truth is, I'm just a cog in the wheels of economy. And my purpose is to consume. So this is 21st century progress. I reached a point where I couldn't relate to anything or anyone, including myself. My mind reacted the only way it knew how, fear. My doctor cleverly diagnosed me with generalized anxiety disorder. Environmental trespasses, oil company B, and I buy every single fucking plastic thingamajiggy that I'm told I need, but I don't really need from colossal company. Friday afternoons is group therapy. Okay, this phenol A, I get up in the middle of the night, I don't know, I don't know what I want. Do I want a cigarette? Do I want a chocolate bar? Do I want both? I don't fucking know. We are a plastic planet full of plastic. Like, take people. a walk outside. Walk into a Walmart. Walk into a fucking Mickey D's. Look around. Do you think these people have souls? No, don't fucking talk to you me about there, a soul. Some, some all this bullshit about how we're all equal and we all have a soul no matter what we do, no matter who we, we are, or where we come from, or what we live. Bullshit that connects us That's to what the it makes me planet. feel. Fear, and that is exactly. Fear. Exactly they do. what you they want. You know, they make every, us everything they make us I dance, do, everything I can do, everything I buy, everything I am. Yeah, yeah. My support group has two rules. No judging, and always buy the next round. I'm sorry, but with all the drugs that people are on all the time, with their pharmaceuticals and they're medicating themselves, that's soulless, man. That has nothing to do with a soul. You know what I think? I mean... You guys will probably disagree, but I think See? they're like, uh, already, already. there are two types of people in this world. You know what I'm talking about. There's yes. creators. I watch it, I want it. And there's consumers. I'd like to think this microwave to too many hours it. that I'm a creator. Fuck yeah. That's exact, come on. <laughs> I'm a creator, I'm sensitive. 
Well, let me ask you a question. How many little blue pills have you had today? How many coffees have you had today? I'm not judging you. I'm not being judgmental. I'm not God. But I'm just asking you, how many blue pills have you taken today? Because frankly, I think that you take a lot. To I think that you take too many. I think you might take too many. You've had, what, 10 coffees oh, today? Easy. Am this I right? World, there's, there's so much anger and hate and, and the social revolution of our time which is bringing up the real people <laughs> in the world, you know? Who wants to go for a cigarette? I'm Medicaid. One in five of us are. And if you're like me, looking for the quick fix, the all-powerful pharmaceutical companies promise happiness, confidence, life without fear. Oddly enough, the pills make me feel like I'm being hugged by an astronaut, floating high above the Earth. No warmth, but at least I'm being held on to. manufacturing process or there was a mix-up with some other meds there had to be an explanation perhaps it's just a bad batch a bad batch really um, what if I took triple quadruple the dose quadruple the dose and risk a seizure absolutely not really if you have questions, see your doctor. Wow. 
watchers, with few spontaneous interactions. It wasn't always like this. For months at a time, I could leave this place, enter another world, another me. Drugs aren't working. What? Dude, that's impossible. No, it's just a rough patch. It's, it's another symptom drugs. of your neuroses. Or it's a it's a side effect of the drugs. Drink. Yes, alcohol. It's the fucking cure all for everything, right? Come on, so, so what is drugs have stopped working? It changes nothing. Come on, drink up, buddy. profile makes me out to be a catch, but honestly, I feel pedestrian, ordinary, part of the target audience. Sit, night after night, page after page of status quo. There must be one shining light, just one. At around 5.30 p.m., she walks south along Saint Laurent Boulevard, takes a right on Villeneuve, and half block down enters the ground floor apartment of a duplex. And bisecting this tangent is me. Fear of being trapped in small spaces. Fear of gas mains exploding without warning. 
fear of simply going insane, but nothing about the sudden, inexplicable failure of anti-anxiety medication. Not one entry. So what am I looking for? Fuck it. Men lie to make themselves look better. Women lie to make others feel better. On here, the great equalizer, everyone lies. Pulcrum est paucorum hominem, the only Latin I remember from grade school. And now, I finally know why. It means beauty is for the few. Of course. I've switched on autopilot. <clears throat> it's scary how easy it is to slip into a role. Hi. It's really nice to meet you. Are both your parents blue-eyed? Like, um, techno? <laughs> Two blue-eyed people cannot have a brown-eyed child. Interesting. I really miss my boyfriend. Wait, whoa, whoa. You, you have a boyfriend? What has one eye, Yeah. two thumbs, and is like great in bed. Mm. Well, he's not really my boyfriend anymore. I could really see you in a teal shirt. I just realized now that I can never be with you. What? I figure if you're still willing to meet me after seeing that picture. Vegetarian. Yeah. Do I strike you as a tacky hipster? What kind of weird dates have you had? <laughs> what? No, I'm joking. No, you really are very cute. No, it's really not you. Especially your blue eyes. It's just that... You know when you're with the right person and then you're with the wrong person? You know who the right person is? <laughs> I'm sure you're gonna find a really, really nice girl that's just meant just for you. Yes, just looking to meet some friends right now, so... I hope that doesn't change the way this date is going for you. You know what? You're a really nice guy. I just... I want to be up front. I just got out of a serious relationship and I'm really not looking for anything. Oh. Wanting it is easy. The act itself has always been a little complicated. What the hell? I fight it. Consume it all. Even you. Take care, Ras. Amen. There is a disconnect. I don't feel grounded. The old tricks aren't working. Taste of music. Thanks. Uh, hey, see you around. For that split second, I could feel again, but just as quickly, I'm back here in my head, not my heart. This is what chews me from the inside out. Consider that 99.99% of all the species in the history of the world have gone extinct. And so my greatest fear, what if it all means nothing?
my name is Erasmus. <laughs>